We are driving through the south and stopping at what we think are two of the world's best gas stations. We think you're gonna think so too. Our first stop today is here at Bucky's. This quirky chain of gas stations are primarily located in Texas, but there happens to be one here in Alabama now, and we're gonna go inside. It's been a couple years since we've been into one, but man, they are a trip. I mean, you gotta get your gas here, but you will find so much more at Bucky's. We've got our dog with us, so Jeremy and I are gonna take turns, and then we're gonna see what each other got. Oh wow, Bucky's pays pretty well too. Dang, it's busy in here. It is so busy in here. But my first stop is always the restroom. Gotta go in there. Can't show it to you because it's probably busy in there too. I'm standing in one corner. If you can just get an idea of how giant this place is. It's huge. Whoa, I love the Bucky's glow in the dark Halloween stuff. So many pickled things. All pretty reasonably priced. They have an assortment of pre-packaged beef jerky, but they also have a counter that serves beef jerky as well. If I recall, this beef jerky flavor is the best one we've had so far. They have one whole wall of just gummies. Everywhere you turn, there's Bucky's branded stuff. I love all of the Bucky branded merchandise. That is a great pullover. Oh my gosh, it's so good. It's so good, it's all so good. Ooh, pink tie-dye, matching set. <laughs> Heck yeah. Patriotic Bucky shirt. <laughs> now we're talking. I wanna decorate my house with Bucky stuff. That would be a great theme. Bedazzled wine glasses. Very tempting. They even have a Bucky pillow pet. That is great. Most of the Buckies are in Texas and they usually have all kinds of Texas themed stuff. So I'm happy to see that here in Alabama they got all the Alabama themed stuff. I've now reached the outdoor and fishing section. We're near the beach so we gotta have a beach section too. Rainbows. I love rainbows beach towels in such good varieties of choices. This area is like a giant mega version of the Cracker Barrel store that they have in the front of the Cracker Barrel. I hit the area that smells sugary and delicious where they roast peanuts and make fudge. I gotta see what Jeremy got. Okay, Bucky's like Nuggies. Bucky Nuggies. All right. So we got some mini cookies that we are told are better than the beaver nuggets. They say they're beaver nuggets cookie cousin, so. Okay. Some garlic beef jerky. <laughs> the Bucky's versions of Cheetos, which I pulled before the Nuggies and I just kept them. I think you, did you try those before? I don't remember. And then I got a brisket sandwich. I was pretty sad that they didn't have breakfast sandwiches because as I recall, their breakfast sandwiches are my favorite. I got something, I think it's called a kolache. I got the sausage and pepper jack version. It was funny because I think that they're pronounced kolache, but I'm not totally sure. But everyone in line that was ordering one was like, uh, I'll, I'll have the uh, ham and cheese, uh, the thing. I'll have the, uh, the sausage. Uh, the sausage and cheese one. <laughs> so I never heard anyone say it. Oh, I just ripped it open. It's like have a sausage. It's in like it. a sausage in it. It's like a wiener wrap kind of. All right, now I gotta take a bite the normal way. Mmm. It seems familiar. Maybe I have had one of these before. Yeah, it's good. It's got like a nice sausage. Got a little cheese in there, and the bread is like a sweet bread. You wanna try it? Sure. I mean, it's no breakfast sandwich, but it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's not too spicy either. No, it's nice. They had a jalapeno one and now I kind of want to wish I would have gotten that one instead. All right, let's try your sandwich. A brisket barbecue sandwich. It's good, it's smoky, brisket, barbecue sauce, pickle. Oh, I see onion in there. There is onion. Like grilled onion, yum. Mm -hmm. You know, for a chain gas station sandwich. It's pretty good. It's a pretty darn good brisket sandwich. Yeah. 
You know, I feel like every time we go to Bucky's, we try like new different things because they just have so much stuff there. But like the one thing I love about Bucky's is they have great clean bathrooms and they have like giant delightful sodas where like they're all their brands or I think they have other well, they have brands too stuff. but I think they have coke and but they have too, a but. ton of their own brands like mm -hmm. bucky brands of sodas and they're all like all the ones we've tried are really good mm -hmm. we have one more gas station that we want to stop at and it's one that we've never been to before there are a few of them in Florida but People say that they're pretty cool. Uh, I, I don't know how it's gonna compare to Bucky's, but we're about to find out. There are several locations of Busy Bee all over Northern Florida, but this one is supposed to be the best one, and I believe the biggest one. I'm standing in what is essentially the same corner, so it's quite large, maybe not as large as Bucky's the general Cracker Barrel gift shop area. All the underpants you need. Lots of branded merchandise. A beer cave. Ten layer pineapple cake. Yum. I had to get a couple things. I couldn't resist. First of all, they had this, it's like, I think like a caramel corn mix that has peanuts. It's called Bee Papa, and when I saw this, I sang to myself, I love it when they call it Bee Papa. Throw your hands in the air if he's a true, true. bee. -er. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. It's like Biggie, but it's a bee. <laughs> Honestly, overall, it kind of just seems like it's trying to be like Bucky's. Like Bucky's has just this cult following. Yeah. It's a really cool gas station. And this is pretty cool. Like they're they're working on it. It's yeah. not quite as good, but it does have a few gems. B Papa being one of them. The other is that the bathrooms are beautiful. I didn't want to film inside them. I wish I could have. Um, I didn't want to film in like the main part of the bathroom because there were just so many people But I did take video of my stall because it was like big was your stall big like big, I, They I were guess. all like a handicap stall like I could like walk around and Similar, it was like though to Bucky's it was like it's like a Hilton though. It had big fancy lamps There is a man in mine and he got very embarrassed because he came <laughs> out and realized he was in a bathroom full of ladies It was great <laughs> Right. It's probably the best bathroom in a gas station. Okay. It was like a Hilton. All right. Anyway. <laughs> I mean, I feel like even if you're trying to be Bucky's, that still makes you better than most gas stations. Yeah, yeah. And like, it did have a couple things. Like that, that bathroom was better than Bucky's. Not that like Bucky's has lovely clean bathrooms, but that was fancier. So. Okay. Let's try Be Papa because I hope I didn't hype it up because it sounds amazing. I think it's just. Like caramel corn like, with peanuts? Yeah, it's probably like good caramel corn. It's good caramel corn. Mm-hmm. It is. It smells like peanut butter to me. A little bit. It doesn't have it in it. It doesn't taste like it specifically. Maybe the peanuts in it just it Must it just smelly. be the peanuts, yeah. It's it's good caramel corn. That is good caramel corn, and it has a great name. It I does love have a good it. Name. I love it. Thanks, Bee Papa. <laughs> this is a peanut butter cup. That is the size of a hostess cupcake. It is, but it's like Hard chocolate. <laughs> I couldn't resist. Mmm, the chocolate is really hard and really thick, but that thick peanut butter filling is delightful. Is it my favorite peanut butter cup? No. No, but it's good. But it's a solid peanut butter cup and it's giant. Yeah, that's a good peanut butter I cup. I think that the chocolate is like almost too thick. It's like hard to even get a bite of it, but the peanut butter is so good. <laughs> so we've learned. Busy Bee. Not quite as good as Bucky's, but still definitely worth stopping at mm -hmm. if you're near one. Yeah, and there's a bunch in Florida, so now we know. There is an alternative because 
the Bucky's isn't built in Florida yet. Have you ever been to Busy Bee or Bucky's? If there's something from either one of those places that you're like, yeah, you gotta have that. Let us know. Let us know. Because the next time we come, we have stuff we can get. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming along with us. Thank you to our patrons for supporting our channel. If you're new here, click that subscribe button and uh, check out one of these videos. We'll see you soon. <laughs> Bye.